Well, this place is ready. We'll be right back to get this series started in just a minute. Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. MLB The Show brings you the National League Championship Series. It's the Los Angeles Dodgers going up against the Atlanta Braves. John Shambi on the play-by-play -play with you. Chris Singleton providing the color. Game one is always critical in a postseason series, Singy. Yeah, and this is when you love having home field advantage, Boog. If you capture game one, you're full of confidence that you've got a chance to ride that momentum for the rest of the series. And on the visiting side, starting pitching is always the big key in a game like this to kick off a series. Yeah, you need a strong performance on the mound. That's the number one way to cancel out the home field edge we just mentioned. First pitch coming your way next. And next for Atlanta, Gerald Raymond. He is quite an athlete. I mean, you look around the other sports, basketball, football, you feel like he could thrive in one of those sports too. Crushed in the air, left center field, way back there, no doubt about it. He circles the bases, and they throw three on the board. It's 3-0. That's the exact definition of hitting the ball where it's pitched, taking that outside fastball and driving it the opposite way out of the ballpark. You want to bottle that type of approach. Now the Atlanta cleanup hitter, Gerald Raymond. It's been such a good hitter with runners in scoring position. Some guys just take it to another level. For him right now at the plate, it's like everyone else is in slow motion and he's in full speed. That one is absolutely oh, belted. Go. Up, That's ball. going back. Up, back some more. And that one is gone. His second homer of this series, and they add to the lead. It's 6-3. He ambushed him right there, Siggy. Yeah, swinging on that first pitch, and I think losing one over the fence is exactly what he had in mind as well. With a low 90s fastball, you have to live on the edges and hit your spots. If you don't, you'll get hit hard. Really good swing there. Patient, waited for it. He's like BP all over. One down. And now the big time power threat, Gerald Raymond. Pretty amazing athlete this guy is. Power and speed, quite a threat. I mean, you're talking about someone that could steal your bag and go deep. Bo Jackson, anyone? And a foul ball. And here it comes. Hey, Slice the other way. That's a base hit. Seems like he got exactly what he was looking for right there. That pretty much split the zone down the middle, and those are the ones where you got to make them pay. And now here is Julio Rodriguez. And a pitch. Here's a strike. And a pitch. Runner on the go. Bounced out to short, and it gets by him. Just one of those seen eye base hits through the infield. He just kind of rolled over on it a little bit, but sometimes those can find a hole and get you a knock. Here's the center fielder, Michael Harris. the count two and one 
That one missed. Riding to the plate, and they're all loaded up. Maybe a little loss of focus on the mound right there. Pretty much gifted him first base with a quick free pass. And up to the plate comes Cody Bellinger. Next offering is foul back. Hey, you can do it, kid. No one better up there. Let's go. Next one is off the play, and that's ball two. And a pitch. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Left-hand hitter waits. And that one is lifted in the air. Vaughn puts it away. Runner tags for home. That's a sacrifice fly as he comes across, and it's 8-3. Well, he'll take the sack fly on the mound right there. Base is loaded. I mean, this is a high leverage situation, and if you can limit the other team, you're doing pretty good work. See if he can get this next out. Gerald Raymond next up for the Braves. He's not going to get cheated up there. No, he's not. He's looking to do damage with every swing he takes. Next pitch has popped up. And the infield fly rule call. We saw both teams come ready to swing it in this one, and they found a lot of success. A couple of touchdowns up on the board today. Pretty amazing, and it turned out to be a close one, considering all the runs put up really wild. And your final 10-7. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew, I'm John Chompy saying so long.